Propofol is made from soybean oil and egg lecithin. If you have a soy allergy or egg allergy, the propofol package insert by Pfizer actually says that it is a contraindication. However, when patients have food allergies, they're allergic to the protein in the food. And the component that's going into propofol itself is just the oil. It's used to emulsify and stabilize the drug and solution. So patients are not typically allergic to the oil in these products. The other thing I would consider contraindication would be a history of propofol infusion syndrome. It wouldn't necessarily be a hard stop for me for giving like a one-time dose to induce general anesthesia. I might consider avoiding it, but I wouldn't 100% rule it out. Propofol infusion syndrome happens when patients are on propofol infusions for many days and it can be like a fatal occurrence, but it doesn't necessarily mean that it's going to happen, you know, with a one-time injection. That being said, it would give me pause and I would probably prefer to avoid it if I could.